Here we're going to interface an Excel spreadsheet with MATLAB. So I've got a, a spreadsheet I just made up over here. And uh, year, January, February, March, April, May, June, the first six months of each year for years 2001, 2, 3, and 4. And we're looking at Ab Alabama robbery statistics for these years, just for the first six months of each year. And I just made up these, these numbers and put them in. I want to get these numbers into MATLAB. How do I do that? Well, all right, let's go over here to MATLAB now. And I go over here to Workspace, and I'm going to make a, uh, a variable, a new variable. And I'm going to call this new variable, originally, very original name, X. There we go. Now I click on X, and uh, let's see, I right-click on them, and oh, do that again, and it says Open Selection. So I click on Open Selection, and this grid shows up. Wow. Okay, that's what I want. I want that grid. So now I'm going to go back over to my uh, Fake Crime Stats worksheet, and uh, I'm going to highlight all of these numbers. 2001, all of them. No, no, no string data, just the numbers. And I'm going to highlight them all and copy. Control C. Now I'm going to minimize this. Click over here in row one, column one, and paste. Control V. And in they go. Wow. I just got them all in there. And now I'm going to click on the X here. Closes it up. And they're now in this variable. I have populated this variable with all those values. Double click on it. I'll double click, right click, and open selection, and there they are. All right, now I want to reference those values. So I key in X and enter. Oh, nasty. How do I? I only want to see um, the. I want to see the years 2001, 2002, 2003, and 2004, but I only want to see. Uh, oh, I don't know. Uh, January and February. How would I say that? X. Show me the value x, the variable x. I want to see rows 1 through 4, and I want to see col columns 1 through January, February, March 3. There we go. Let's see how that works. Oh, that looks messy. I need a, more space here. Okay, let me move that over. And let's key that command in again. And, oh, still not enough space. Move this over. Again. Oh, that's good. I like this. 2001. 50 and 55, 2002, 50, 48. So, what did that do? That showed me columns 1, 2, and 3. Here's column 1. Here's column 1. This guy there. Here's column 2. This guy here. And here's column 3. This guy there. So that's what this command does. Show me the first four rows and the first three columns. And I get exactly what I wanted. I could experiment. I could say, show me uh, rows one through through two and columns one through two. And that would give me just the first two years of January. January figures. And that's how you do it. That's all I want to talk about right now. So thanks for listening. This is George Wool. I want to keep this short and sweet. Saying bye-bye.